Hello, my name is Andrew and I'm the pastor here at Broadmead Baptist Church and we're having a uh, building project, a fundraising project at the moment because we need to redecorate uh, the right hand side of our church building um, because it's made of wood and as you'll see in a moment uh, we uh, have some work that really does need doing on this whole side of the building. This whole uh, project has been quoted, we've got two quotes from local builders um, to make this all good and uh, what we need to do basically is paint and replace some parts of the windows uh, with uh, materials that can make it waterproof so that we will be able to use the buildings for the next few years. If you follow me round here I'll show you uh, this side of the building. Uh, this present part that you're looking at is uh, used as a storage space. This is for want of a better word the garage and that's a storage space and unfortunately damp has started to come in there now so we really do need to get that uh, done. This next part of the building is what we call in the church we call it the laser room that's our young people's and youth room and it's also used as a staff room for the nursery during the week and uh, as you will see the windows probably if we were going to keep the building long term would need replacing but basically, for the moment, what we need to do is get them decorated and made uh, safe so that no damp comes in in the next few years. If you'll follow me further along, you'll see that this building here is a, a larger hall. It's called the Large Hall. And this is, by the way, the original church building. Uh, the original church building uh, before um, the sanctuary was built. And uh, this is the building that people used to uh, worship in. Now it's used as a large hall for various events, for Parkinson's, for Zumba, for Sunday school, for church meetings. And again, we need to get it decorated uh, and made good uh, and up to standard. Basically, this side of the building is um, the alleyway and then leading down to the river and it weathers the most worst uh, of all the uh, area on the site. And so we need to get this decorated and uh, 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 made good over the next, uh, so that it'll last over the next few years. And so if you'll follow me to the front, I'll show you the last part that we need to be decorated. Of course, dear friends, our long-term plan is to demolish this whole side and uh, make it into a long-term brick building. And we have a plan over 10 years to do that. But we need to grow the church building, uh, church fellowship first. And so in the meantime, we need to get this work done so that we can continue to use the buildings for God's glory and for community use and church use. You'll see that this final part of the building faces the front of the game, needs decorating to ensure that damp does not come through. So that is the target we've raised. Uh, we're uh, planning to have a target of £15,000, which we need to raise to finance this work. And we're asking dear friends from the fellowship and members and fellowship of the church, people known to the church, if they will be able to give uh, some money towards this project. As I said, we've got two quotes and we believe that this work needs doing uh, in the next uh, few months so that we can continue to use this building for God's glory and that we can continue with our long-term plans for the fellowship. So God bless you. Please consider if you're able to uh, give to this cause and thank you but most importantly please do be praying for us as we try to bring the buildings at this side of the building up to standard thank you very much <laughs>